In order to perform a checkout and check-in transaction for assets using the mobile scanner, we begin by tapping the checkout icon that's on the touch screen. Once you've done that, the checkout form will load, and at that point, if you want to reference a reservation that you've created, either scan the reservation barcode that's been printed out, or tap the reservation line with the stylus, and you can perform a search for that reservation number. Once you find the reservation number, simply click it to select it, and then choose the Select button in the bottom. You'll notice that everything will automatically populate, so at that point you can simply click the Save button, and that will complete the transaction. You'll also notice that the Checkout to Location and the Checkout to Custodian field have looped, and this will allow you to check out additional assets to the same person and same location. Now, if you're performing a checkout transaction and you're not referencing a reservation, to begin, simply tap the Checkout icon on the screen, and once the checkout form loads, scan the location where the item is being checked out to. And next, you'll scan the barcode for the custodian that will be checking the item out. Once you scan the lo location barcode and the custodian barcode, you'll scan the asset. And then once you scan the asset barcode, tap the Save button and that will save the transaction. And again, the checkout to custodian and checkout to location fields will loop, allowing you to check out additional assets to the same location and the same custodian. And finally, to perform a check-in transaction once items have been checked out, tap the check-in icon that's located on the mobile scanner. And once the check-in form loads, at that point you'll scan the barcode for the custodian who will be receiving it during the check-in. Once you've scanned the check-in to custodian field, at that point you'll simply scan the assets that are being checked in. And once you've scanned the barcode for the assets that are being checked in, you tap save. And that will complete the process. To check in additional assets, just repeat that same process, click save, and the record will be saved in the database.